Cuba's wet season begins in May, and yet again they have rain clouds drifting nearby. This time, all courtesy of a frontal system, which will bring a lot more rainfall for the Bahamas, and eventually shifting towards eastern areas of Cuba. You can see it there, the grey colours signifying the clouds, and the green colours where you'll likely see the rainfall. So no surprise then that Havana will begin to see some late showers coming through, and uh, only a high of 33 expected, and then you'll see some of those uh, thunderous showers later on going into Wednesday and later on into Thursday as well. For all Jamaica, it's windy and hazy. There's also some Saharan dust along the south coast of Hispaniola. Maybe a few brief showers expected around Port-au-Prince, but still quite uh, gusty as well with a high of 35 degrees Celsius there. For the Eastern Caribbean, it remains uh, settled. A lot more sunshine to come for the Leeward Islands, St. John's and Bastyr, seeing a lot more sunshine here. Down towards Dominica and uh, St. Lucia, there's a few brief showers expected, 32 for Roseau, 31 expected for Bridgetown with a few brief showers and a finger of moisture coming down towards uh, Grenada. Up towards uh, Georgetown, it's dull and cloudy and a high of 31 degrees Celsius expected there. So that's your Caribbean travel forecast and that's it for me.